matter kid washing hands he is not able to hold water why i am not able to hold water but i can hold soap yes because the state of both the material is different soap is solid and water is liquid i did not understand please explain this concept let me explain to you the earth we live on is a beautiful planet there are many things around us sun moon buildings animal plants soil books air etc they are all made up of different materials but have something in common all materials are made up of matter what is matter anything that has mass and occupies space is called matter the air we breathe in the food we eat the water we drink and even our bodies are all examples of matter matter exists in three states solid liquid and gas what is matter made up of matter is made up of tiny invisible particles called molecules as an example suppose we break a piece of chalk what would you observe you would find that it breaks into smaller pieces if we keep on breaking these pieces they would become smaller and smaller till they become a powder scientists can break down the particles even further till they become so tiny that they are no longer visible these tiny invisible particles are called molecules states of matter all matter is made up of molecules depending on the way these molecules are arranged matter can exist in three states solid liquid and gas solids solids are hard and cannot be pressed in a solid the molecules are packed very close to each other since the molecules are packed together there is very little space between them as a result they cannot move freely this makes solids hard and gives them a fixed shape In other words, solids have a definite shape and fixed volume. Example: Shape of a book stays the same whether you put it in a bag or place it on table. Liquids: You cannot press or hold a liquid. In a liquid, the molecules are not packed very closely together. Since there is more space between the molecules of a liquid as compared to solid, liquids have no fixed shape and can flow in other words liquids have no fixed shape but they have a fixed volume gases you cannot press or hold the liquid in a gas the molecules are packed very loosely the molecules are free to move in any direction as the molecules can spread easily the space between the particles keep on changing Thus gases have no fixed shape or volume. 